Hey guys, Harry Thomas here, and happy birthday to John Williams. That's right, the uh, well, the greatest composers of all time just turned 85 today, and uh, wish him a very happy birthday in the comments below. That would be great, and uh, I love John Williams. Uh, he has been composing for uh, so many wonderful years on countless movies uh, and, and classics, and... Uh, uh, I thought it, this would be the perfect uh, time uh, to uh, upload my top 10 best uh, John Williams scores list uh, now I and I'd love to hear your uh, list of your favorite John Williams scores in the comments below so without further ado let's uh, start at number 10 and work our way up to number one number 10 on my list these visitors certainly do not come in peace in uh, Steven Spielberg's outstanding and and uh, so underrated remake of uh, the uh, Alien Invasion classic War of the Worlds. Uh, John Williams scored perfectly up the stakes and uh, and heightened the tension and uh, raised the intensity of every scene in this uh, uh, awesome, epic uh, remake of, of a classic, which I think tops the original War of the Worlds in every way, though some won't agree with me, but that's my opinion, yeah. Uh, John... Uh, John Williams' score is, uh, you can't deny, even if you don't like it, is a major highlight of this movie and uh, should not be overlooked. Number 9 on my list, this may surprise some of you, but uh, I I think uh, the, the score for Steven Spielberg's War Horse is, uh, is wonderful and, uh, and uh, deserves to be saluted, as they do in the British Army. Uh, this, especially the scores are for the war scenes and and that ending salute are oh, just a truly magnificent S such an epic sweep to it uh yeah war horse i think is one of again one of spielberg's most underrated films along with war of the worlds and uh and the the score helped uh, the war scenes uh, be uh, equally as intense as Saving Private Ryan. Speaking of Saving Private Ryan, that is indeed my number eight choice. Uh, this has the best soundtrack of any war movie ever made, uh, being well the best war movie ever made by far uh, to this day. And John Williams' score in the opening uh, uh, perfectly sums up the tone for the film. And uh, the rest, the score for the rest of the movie, just so, so epic and uh, awe-inspiring and completely harrowing, and uh, and uh, just it's de it's a delight for your ears as as even the scenes there uh, without sound and save or music in Saving Private Ryan were intense, but whenever there was music. It was epic. Dun da 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 da. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? It's Superman. That's right. A John Williams Superman theme is the definitive Superman theme. Oh my gosh, that one of the most iconic, uh, uh, most uh, classic, uh, timeless uh, themes for a superhero movie ever. Period. Um, how many superhero themes have ever topped this? Seriously, and. It, it, without uh, this score, the original 1978 Superman movie would still have been a great movie, but John Williams' score uh, perks it up to a perfect uh, 10 out of 10. E.T. Go Home as E.T., the extraterrestrial, the the music for E.T. is utter, pure, utterly magical. Oh my gosh. Uh, uh, E.T., of course, is one of the most timeless, classic, greatest family films ever made, and... Uh, will forever uh, remain uh, untoppable in that category and uh, the uh, score by John Williams here it's uh, it's once again a uh, spectacular wonderful utterly charming and inviting and uh, and gets uh, the spirit and the heart of the film a spot on dun 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 the greatest horror movie ever made uh, that uh, made people uh, fear the great white shark everywhere they go jaws that that's right uh, john williams is a classic intense uh, score in the opening of the film uh, perfectly sets the tone for the film uh, makes you fear the shark and uh, and braces you for the impact of the attack and uh, just uh, is a uh, uh, no wonder it's countlessly used in pop culture references of shark attacks uh, because uh, whenever you think of a great white shark you think of uh, the John uh, Williams Jaws theme. Speaking of Jaws as uh, Steven Spielberg's uh, other great uh, monster movie da 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 Jurassic Park uh, that's uh, right uh, greatest dinosaur movie ever made well uh, 
along with the land before time, of course, uh, but uh, the uh, Jurassic Park uh, theme is so beautiful, magnificent, uh, sweeping and elegant, and uh, and makes you feel like you're a part of the dinosaurs, and uh, and it's particularly uh, using it in the scene where Richard Attenborough's like, welcome to Jurassic Park, it's incredibly effective, and, uh, and makes you want to explore this uh, phenomenal world. Dun 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 That's right, uh, the greatest adventurer of all time as well as badass most fucking awesome themes in the history of cinema, uh the Indiana Jones theme. Where you cannot have an Indiana Jones theme without so the classic John Williams Indiana Jones theme. That would be absolute sacrilege. Uh, whenever you hear this theme, you think Indiana Jones, uh, you know right off the bat it's Indiana Jones, and no wonder this theme has been played in countless action movies and has inspired a countless composers to write scores like this, only only they have yet to reach uh, the uh, sensational uh, awesomeness of this theme. Dun 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 as as the timeless classic Hedwig's theme for Harry Potter. This, whenever you hear this music, you just know it's Harry Potter, not any other franchise. It captures the, the magic, uh, the uh, mythology and the beauty and the grandeur of uh, J.K. Rowling's The Wizarding World and completely immerses you in it. And uh, I can listen to Hedwig's theme for just... Uh, for just uh, the rest of my life, I, I'm being serious, so I could listen to that every day, and I'm proud to call the, the Harry Potter John Williams theme the second best John Williams theme, it would be number one, if not uh, for a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away, yeah, you all will know what it is. Dun, 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 that's right, uh, taking us back to a galaxy far Far away is none other than the John Williams theme for Star Wars. What else can I say? It's perfect. It's by far John Williams' best, most recognised and definitive theme. Uh, you cannot have a Star Wars movie without John Williams scoring it. I mean, I thought it was an absolute crime against humanity that John Williams did not compose the score for Rogue One, which is why it's by far the weakest Star Wars score for me. The score for all the others, though, absolutely flawless, absolutely timeless, absolutely masterful, and uh, and truly a, a, a classic theme in its own right that will forever be remembered throughout uh, not just cinema history, but human history. Whenever you hear John Williams' Star Wars um, theme, uh, you, uh, you just want to go to the Star Wars galaxy and learn the ways of the Force and become a Jedi yourself. And uh, I, boy, I cannot wait to see what John Williams has in store for the soundtrack of The Last Jedi coming out this December. It should be his most epic, yes. So those are my top 10 favourite John Williams scores. And happy 85th birthday to you, John. I have the entire box set of John Williams soundtracks. I shall be listening to them uh, for the rest of the day. But uh, for the rest of you, I love you guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this top 10 list. And uh, what are your uh, favourite John Williams uh, scores? Uh, please comment and let me know. Please like this video and subscribe. Uh, it means so much to me to uh, new subscribers. I have rapidly been gaining subscribers uh, recently. And... And thank you all, I love meeting new people. So as well as subscribing, please follow me on Twitter and on Google Plus, and I'll see you all uh, next time when I review the Lego movie, and I'll see you then. Bye, guys.